Welcome to artisanenglish.jp's, the posts, the podcast. The more vocabulary you know, the richer your conversation will be, so let's learn some vocab. Today our topic is Hard feelings Don't forget to like and subscribe. You'll receive the benefit of daily updates and will have the opportunity to help you improve your English repertoire. Thanks. It's Friday the 13th. If you are reading this, I hope you are in bed with the doors locked and have called in sick today. If there's anyone out there in the world who has hard feelings towards you, they may come and get you today. This day has a bloody history of people who have hard feelings towards someone going out and killing them or having them killed. Hard feelings are feelings of resentment, anger or bitterness towards someone you have had an argument or disagreement with. 13 is not a good number, and when Friday falls on the 13th, let's just say it's not a day of celebration. The night before Jesus Christ was crucified, he had dinner with 13 people. The 13th person, Judas, told the police about Jesus's location in return for 30 silver coins. On Friday, October 13, 1307, 213s, the French King Philip had the Knights Templar suddenly arrested early in the morning. Later they were tortured and burned. The king had hard feelings toward the Knights Templar because they had too much power and money. If those two events don't give you nightmares, perhaps a figure from more modern times will. Jason is the main character from the Friday the 13th film series. I've never seen the movies because I'm not into horror. However, if you're not Christian and couldn't care less about how many knights died 800 years ago, Jason will scare your socks off. He runs around in the dark with dangerous sharp things such as chainsaws and blades killing people. He has 25 victims so far. If anyone has hard feelings toward you, I suggest you not invite 13 friends to your house for supper, upset the French king or talk to any guys named Jason tonight. Thanks for putting us into your ears. ArtisanEnglish.jp is your place for 100% correction great conversation, and authentic communication. Until next time, maintain your discipline, and learn something new every day.